Hi guys, my name is Kelsey. And my name is Becky. And we are the Star Girls. And we're back with another episode of Thrift Flip, and this time it's holiday themed. You guys love it, we love it too. And Becky has a new house. If you saw that vlog, I bought a house, which is crazy exciting, but with uh, a new house, it means I own nothing. So I own no Christmas anything. I have a really sad blank tree, and we want to make it awesome. Yeah, so this is us turning thrift flip <laughs> items into a gorgeous tree. Okay, let's go, let's go. <laughs> I think I like the tan one better. This one? Yeah. Okay. Guess. 30 bucks. 70. What? This is so the right vibe. Too. Okay, I love that, I love that, I love that. All right, let's, let's haul it. Let's do a haul, oh my God. Okay, so basically the purpose behind this is this is gonna be the tree skirt, aka pot, aka tree pot. I've noticed like a big trend now. People are putting their trees in baskets, and I kind of love it. It's so so we're gonna try cute. it. So cute. And at the same time, we got this from the kids section. It's like a little baby shawl, like a cape. Like a cape. Also, okay, so I just got this bag of random ornaments on the real cheap that had some pine cones in it that were white, so those go with the theme. Mm -hmm. So, so cheap. So I think it'd be sweet to make like a garland out of this maybe. Although, hold up. Wait, it is a, <laughs> that thing took away our DIY idea. I wasn't even gonna do a tree topper just cause I didn't know what I wanted, but then we saw this star and it totally called to us. Mm -hmm. uh, it's so beautiful. Mm -hmm. This, you're like, wait, what, <laughs> what do um, these toys have to do with Christmas? We also picked up these giant um, jingle bells. Oh my God, they're really cute and really noisy. And this whole bucket of bells was $1.70. Yes. Holla. Bargain. So yeah, on top of on top of the thrift store, we did also go to the dollar store to get some secondary pieces to add to the tree because the dollar store is honestly just as cheap as a thrift mm. store. So they had these um, gold tipped feathers that we can do something with. These snowy, frosty pine cones. Yep, these um, balls of pom-pom. Uh, we also went to the fabric store and got some string. So guess what? Who's making a garland? It's gonna be like that little cape, but garland form. Oh my God. And then here's the ribbon that we're gonna use to make some ornaments with. Bless up, I'm so excited. Let's go! <laughs> Since we're trying to stick with a theme, we're painting all of these random bulbs white. Once dry, we're going to glitterify them, coat the bulb in white liquid glue, and then pour on some glitter. We're gonna turn these plastic animal toys into tree ornaments. Start by covering them with white spray paint. Tip, spray paint works great on plastic toys, but not so great on rubber ones. Once dry, we're screwing in some tiny screw eyes so we can add a string for hanging. We went with fishing wire so it would be unnoticeable on the tree. To bring some life back into these white animals, we're using liquid gold leaf to paint on some details. A paint pen would also work great for this. This pom-pom garland is super simple to make. Hot glue the pom-poms onto your yarn or string. We spaced ours out every seven inches and that's it. For this ornament, we're going to wrap it with twine. Use hot glue to periodically add dots of glue to keep the twine in place. Keep wrapping until you get to the bottom and can curl up the twine and end the wrapping. We're going to jazz up these pine cones by first adding some ribbon strings. Knot a loop of ribbon and then glue it onto the top of the pine cone. Next, we're tying bows out of a different ribbon. Glue the bows on to cover up the knot. We made over these little nests by giving them a light coat of white paint for a frosted effect. We added in some of our gold dipped feathers. Keep going, keep going. There? Yeah, stop. There. All right, so we're here at my house and we have this tree, like we said, and it's really bare. So now it's time to put everything that we just crafted onto the tree. These are fairy lights, which are often cheaper and cuter than a standard string of Christmas lights. And you can get these from the dollar store. Our tree stand didn't end up fitting in the basket, so we cut out the back so it could sit around the stand. We laid on the children's pom-pom cape and placed it under the tree.
Okay, so I absolutely love how this turned out. It's what I would have designed if I had gone to the store and bought them anyways. Yeah, and this was like under $50. We did the math, we wrote down everything that we bought for this tree and it was like 40 something, which yeah. is incredible. And that included the basket at the bottom, which that, the basket and like the little shawl thing together were like $9, so. If you just wanted to decorate a tree, it'd be like 35 bucks. Oh my gosh. Don't go to the stores and spend money on ornaments, basically. And I like giving life to old things instead of buying new stuff from the store. So. Yeah. Good work, team. Recycle, <laughs> upcycle. We do a lot of these recycling upcycling videos. We have a whole thrift flip series, so I'll link a playlist. You can see all the other things that we've made over before. And we have a few more Christmas videos coming out, including a Wrap With Me live video yeah. show. Video. Live show. That's gonna be Sunday, December 11th. We're gonna be just chilling, wrapping our Christmas presents, giving you some wrapping inspo and ideas, and you can wrap your presents with us. And we'll like engage with you on the twits or the comments, you know. You know, you know. And we got all these amazing ideas for our Christmas videos from our Snapchat viewers and our Instagram fans. So go over to those different platforms and make sure you're following us so that when we ask you for ideas, you can comment. Come through. Yes, that's so helpful. <laughs> all right, thank you guys so much for watching this video. If you like this and you like the tree and how everything turned out, make sure you actually like this. And if you love it, make sure you sub it so you don't miss more Christmas videos coming up soon. And we'll see you next time. Bye.